The clubhouses of the Ancient Eight are called tombs because they were built without windows. In some cases, they were deliberately built to evoke um, the sinister or the arcane. But in a lot of cases, they were meant to be closed off from the world, not just to prevent people from seeing in because they were secret, but also because those inside were supposed to be focused on what was happening there and turning inward to the life of the mind as opposed to looking outward. They're really extraordinary buildings and the Skull and Bones tomb has a kind of um, Egyptian temple feel. Book and Snake is built in this neoclassical mode. Wolf's Head has had two tombs and both of them had windows because they were showing how egalitarian and forward thinking they were. Um, my favorite of the tombs is actually the Scroll and Key tomb. It has this beautiful Moorish facade. It's uh, just an extraordinarily beautiful building. But you can walk around campus and see all of them there and it's easy to, to not notice them as much as notice them sort of tucked between all of these gothic buildings.